Hey, it's Ginger Boy. Welcome back once again to Mushroom Kingdom Meltdown. On to bonus one. The bonusy bonus video of Bonus Town. I have no idea uh, how this is going to be. And possibly hoping that these were made after the lack of motivation. That was the end of the game. Because that was just... It was kind of painful to play. Just seeing how poorly the end of the game was made. It just kind of ruined a good portion of uh, respect for the game. Because up until then, yeah, slow down due to... Uh, old hack versus newer emulator and poorly optimized uh, patches slash tools slash other things because it seems like if there's more than four sprites uh, around then the game lags really really horribly to be honest but uh, that is just what it seems like, because even here, with three sprites around, it's just lagging real bad. Which is one of the main reasons why I'm going kind of out of my way to kill things. Not extremely out of the way, just kind of. Because it helps with the lag that's happening. Also, I'm kind of wondering why those plants don't go all the way into the pipe. Also, this is kind of messed up graphically. Um, can I know what is the purpose of that? Just, what is the purpose of that? Also, I th thought I saw a piranha plant in that pipe, but it doesn't seem to be one. It doesn't seem to be one. Yeah, those are clouds. Easy enough to dodge the saw blades. And, oh man, this is... How did I kill it? I don't know. Just let them go, and then I can do that easy enough. And dodge these guys. Also easy enough. For a bonus, I mean, this is fairly competent, fairly decently made as uh, a challenge of sorts. But again, I mean, okay, go down the gray green pipe. And that takes you up here, which is the same part of the level, just up higher. Kind of weird. Why not just add stairs or something? I realized my keyboard was on the ground because I have a wireless keyboard. have a wired mouse, though. Ugh. Okay. Bonus two? Bonus two. Yeah, and even, even with the... Uh, you know, slow down and it being a little bit harder than normal. It still only took me like three and a half minutes to beat, which is just kind of sad. That's even worse. I mean, there's probably like a P-switch that I was supposed to get to go down this pipe and it's supposed to be a longer level, but... Just the fact that I, if with a cape, I can skip the entirety of the level in like 30 seconds. That is, that is very, very poorly designed. So, yeah. Uh, criticisms of this game that's old, old, old. I don't even remember the year date on it. It's like 2008, I think. Which is, like, right before the, uh, hacking revolution. Called a revolution, but it's really not a revolution. 
Uh, it's more like... I don't know. I don't know what you'd call it. Just 2008 seems to be a point in time where hacks got better, tools got better, more defined, patches got better, just everything got better. It's just really weird that it's just like 2008. Also, that level was, again, very, very short. So, like the first bonus one, lots of effort put into it. Bonus two and three, not so much. Even though bonus two, I did skip a huge portion of it, so I might as well just go back because I don't think there's any more past bonus three. Um, I may cheat a bit and look in the uh, Lunar Magics to see if that is a correct assumption or if I'm missing something uh, because I do want to show off as much as I can before just calling it there. Okay, boo buddy. I was supposed to... Yeah, so you were supposed to come over here and grab a P-Switch to be able to complete the level. But even then, I mean, yeah... Okay. Yes, I mean, that jump is possible by itself. But still. Okay. And coming up here, I should be able to... Yeah, so that's all the level. That's the entirety of the level. Which, even with that little P-Switch gathering, is still not <laughs> much added to the gift. Oh boy. That's kind of weird. Oh, it... So I got that right when a lightning was flashing. Okay, now get it. Can I do this without the lightning flash? Because that would be very nice. And there we go. Okay, I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. The only thing that seems to be missing is I'm supposed to be able to have a uh, path over to the level over there. Um, but I don't. And besides, I think that level in itself has already been... Um, Explored? So I don't think... Yeah. I've already done this level, so that's... Not a big... Not a big deal. Anyway, my final, final opinion on this hack, because I feel like I should say something, because I was kind of ranting last video. In total, this hack isn't bad. The main problem with it is the ending sucks. There is a huge curve, like almost a bell curve, um, where the beginning starts off slow. It picks up towards the middle, stays up for a little bit, and then just comes down. So it's like an asymmetrical bell curve of slow pickup, picks up real quick, stays up for a while, and then just drops off. And it's, it's kind of sad, which I know a lot of stuff happens in the sequel, but I also know the sequel isn't all too special either. And this is a hack that could greatly, greatly benefit from being remade. Um, though I don't think uh, the current author, which I don't, remember who it was. Cypher. Actually, Cypher might be doing stuff, but I doubt he's interesting, interested in remaking this um, hack. But uh, that would be... I think remaking this would be so... You could just do so much and even change it around a little bit to add the ending, just make it so much better. Um, and still plot-wise make it tie in perfectly with the second game. Uh, which would be amazing. I mean, uh, 
it would be so fun just playing a remake of this. Kind of like uh, the second Reality Project versus the second Reality Project Reloaded. Uh, if you look at them, the remake was so much better because the original was very based on the original Super Mario World. And it's not that it suffered from that at all, but it definitely was benefited greatly from a re for the remake. The remake just made it better. So that's one thing that I would love to see. It's kind of just a remake of this, just to make it so much better uh, design-wise, graphical, graphically just in general it would be very beneficial but uh, again I am NOT the creator of this hack and without permission I wouldn't touch or try and make a remake which I will say I'm not planning on making a remake of this at all I'm just saying I wouldn't mind doing it if I had permission to do it so anyway that being said, I'm going to end it here. This has been Ninja Boy, and I will be back later with something else. See you guys then.